hope this is going to be a live pregnancy test. Um, I don't think that I'm pregnant just yet, um, but I just want to be sure um, because um, I don't want to, you know, drink or anything like that. Not that I drink anyways, um, because I don't really, but I drink every, you know, once in a while. If my husband's mom has my son, um, and my daughter, whatever, you know. If you watched my last video, you know why I'm trying to get pregnant again so soon. So, that explains everything, but uh, I just want to make sure my period is actually not due until Sunday. Um, and I'm not really having any symptoms other than my breast being a little sore, but that could be my period too. So I'm just taking a cheapo um, pregnancy test from the dollar store that I got. And there's two, so I'm going to retest. But this is only a five day sooner. And if you've watched my um, pregnancy test from when I got pregnant with my daughter, you know that my HCG levels are really low. Um, and for some reason they don't ever show until I'm like a week late so I'm not expecting this to be really anything or to show anything even if I am pregnant right now because I wouldn't expect to see anything until like Thursday of the following week um so anyways my period is due Sunday so it's five days um from now and yeah, let's just go ahead and take the test instead of rambling. So like I said, I just have this dollar store test and I've already opened it. So it just looks like this. It looks just like the Target brand or whatever if you've tried the Equate brand. Um, it's blue dye. I don't typically like those, but I'm not going to sit there and stare at it either. So um, I think it'll be fine. So I'm going to go ahead and dip it and then we'll wait for two minutes. So I'm just going to put it back in the package and let it go. And I'm going to get rid of my pee because we all know what pee looks like. Okay. So I went I dipped it when the clock said two or three so um it'll be done when it hits five so I'll just chat with you for a minute um until it's done so um like I said I'm not expecting anything out of this but um I don't know like with my both pregnancies too another first symptom that I um the only two symptoms that I really like um Seen was my sore breasts and also I got um my nipples got darker and I'm not really seeing that yet and that's why I think if I am pregnant it's too soon um sorry I'm talking so long I don't want my husband to hear because I want it um I don't want him to know yet so anyways um let's see oh why I'm testing as well well, when I got pregnant with my daughter, I kind of tracked everything. So I knew the exact day that I ovulated and the exact day I actually implanted too because I got cramping that day and it wasn't close to my period. Or it was close to my period, obviously, but it was like a week or a week and a half. Or it was like a week before my period, I think. Anyways, I got the implantation. Um... I got the, um, um, the cramping, and, um, I never got any, like, spotting or anything like some people get, I just got the cramping, and about a week ago, I got that, um, and I felt like I was gonna get my period, like I was cramping, and I don't ever, I've never had period cramps, I'm just assuming this is what they'd feel like if you, if someone 
had them. Um, but, uh, I don't know, I got the cramping, no bleeding or anything, so that made me want to test, um, just to be sure. So, but like I said, my period's not due until Sunday, so we'll see. But the clock has hit five minutes and 30 seconds, just about, so I'm going to go ahead and look at the test. I just bought a two pack because I totally was not expecting this at all. I mean, I know I got the cramping and stuff, which I got that with my daughter, but um, I don't really think it's going to change much from, I don't know, maybe it being a cheap test for this morning might be better. Um, but there's seriously a very faint line there. But it said 50% of women on their fourth day get positives. So that goes down. But I never get a positive this soon. It could be maybe it's just this test. I don't know. I know a positive is a positive, but there is definitely a faint line there. Wow. Um I might do the other one tomorrow just to see since it was cheap. And then if I don't get my beer by Sunday, um, buy like a good one and test and do it live for you guys. Um, but I think um, I'm gonna do the other one in the morning just to see what the first morning urine says. Um, but I doubt you're gonna be able to see it because I'm using my front facing camera and it's so faint. I don't know, maybe you can catch a glimpse of it. I don't think you're going to be able to see it. I just think it's way too faint. The lighting is not the best either. I can totally see a really faint line. I don't know. So, it could just be this blue dye test. I'm not sure. I'm going to go ahead and end the video now because it's we're up to nine minutes and I'm not going to keep rambling. Um, however, there will be another video um, coming up. So look for that. Um, it could just be this blue dye because, honestly... I'm not even sure if I see it anymore. I don't know. Who knows? Who knows? I don't know. It looks really... It kind of looks really thin. But it couldn't be evaporation because I just took the dang thing. So I don't know. I could just be seeing things. But they're but honestly... I saw a very big line. I don't know. I'm going to end it here because I don't think I see anything anymore. It could just be really faint or it could be this test since it's blue dye. I'm not sure, but just look up for the next video. So we'll see.